Hello everybody and welcome to the second uh, episode in uh, Inventor to make uh, a connecting uh, road to the V12 uh, engine let's uh, let's start by new file I will close this I will close this one uh, you can configure it to your template to make uh, with uh, design with millimeters and ISO just click here and save it start a new file go to front plan I think is this one okay go to sketch start from line as the first error I have to delete it start from the origin then to make a mark here is just click and drag the first point okay then we have a line here then return to the Return to the first point, then click and drag to make the an arc. Okay. Uh, second thing to do is to just add another arc here. Okay. Then and add the line here. That's for construction. Then add the relation between these and this one and move it. Okay. And uh, you can now add some dimension. <coughs> uh, here we have, I will delete it. Uh, this one uh, make it for construction okay then go to here uh, put here uh, uh, 36 then we have 72 okay then here we have 25 Here we have uh, 3.5, then an angle here with 122mm. This arc has 50 of the radius. I will try this one. Then we have I think I made the mark here, no? Okay. I delete all of these then go to the line I will repeat the same thing you can do it more hmm okay then add the dimension here the same thing we have 50 this arc has 14 distance between these point we have 125 then uh, it's just uh, 
Ah, just a uh, question of uh, tangency between this and this one. Then uh, the sketch is all defined. Add the circle here, one circle here. This one has 50, this one has 18. Use trim to trim this and this one. And I will drag this. I will trim all of these. Then I will add a relation between this point. Okay, then uh, go to mirror, select all of these, mirror line, select this one and apply. I forgot this one. Return to mirror, select it, and click OK. Then go to 3D model, extrude, select the profile, put here 15, then use symmetric and click OK. Select this face, go to sketch, project this one and this circle and add the circle here with a line okay then uh, add the circle another circle here add the relation between these tangency dimension to this one we have 60 use trim to trim all of these i don't know what's the meaning of this but go to uh, extra select this profile and this profile put here 2.5 then select this face again add the slot center to center ok start from this point to this one add a dimension with uh, with a radius of 5 here we have 55 and from this point to the bottom we have 45 then go to 3d model extrude select this profile and use cut with uh, 5 then go to mirror select these features the mirror plan is this one click ok then use the chamfer chamfer with uh, two millimeter here okay leave this uh, distance use uh, edges select all these edges then click ok you if you want add the material then uh, add the plan now click in plan go to this one and uh, click and drag put here 25 select this plan go to sketch add a point here this point from the origin we have 30 and you have to add a relation between them okay then add the center line to make a mirror select uh, the point 
and line of mirror click apply and finish your sketch then go to hole use uh, contour board okay then here we have uh, 11 and here leave it uh, in 2 millimeter here we have uh, 7 okay then uh, click OK then select uh, this uh, <coughs> work plan go to sketch uh, if you can't uh, see anything you can to go to view then uh, change change what 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 this one uh, wireframe okay then select two of these go to sketch project it then go to 3d model extrude select these circles and put here uh, 15 now we can return to view okay shut then uh, the last thing I think we have just to add some uh, some fillet like 3 millimeter here and here and from this side I click OK the same thing with 4 Mm, okay, no, it's not four but five. I verify this with uh, the part in SolidWorks. You can see the tutorial, the same tutorial with SolidWorks in my channel, and I will did it. I will do it uh, with Katia V5 and and uh, another software like uh, like what? like PTC Creo, okay? I will put 4 here the same thing from this side then uh, you can just now add your name here if you like select uh, this uh, face then go to sketch uh, click in text click here for example I will make my logo here V12 engine I click OK then add the relation between this and this one I can't see anything uh, I will go here wireframe Oh, because it's not the add the relation between this one and this one. Go to sketch. Okay. Now I think you can do it. I will put three I will 
delete this one now we have uh, this text is returned then apply go to view shadow with edges then go to 3d model sweep then in bus select to this profile and put here 0 0.2 or 3 whatever you want then select in boss click ok and we have the result ok then you can hide this one and you if you like this tutorial you can just uh, leave me a comment and subscribe to my channel you can just add the name here if you want then uh, in the next episode i will add the, the second part to the connecting route uh, with an assembly okay see you in this tutorial and um, and subscribe if you like it that's all thank you <laughs>